search engines. Dory knows that age, age sites are an extremely valuable thing for incoming links. It doesn't matter how much traffic it gets. It matters how long it's been in the engines and how many links are coming to it. And we're going to show you another tool and a technique that we use to get links. We've got sites that we put up didn't touch ever. We have hundreds and hundreds of quality links coming into the site. One way, not reciprocal. I didn't pay for them. In fact, I don't think I've ever paid for a single link in my entire life. I've always built my own networks so I can control my own links. HD, DVD, and Blu-ray. We built a site about that. She talked about that. I think it was a great market. It's a great idea. So we'd already built a site about that for the summer just to show you guys what can be done with it. I'm sorry, Pablo. Go ahead. In the uh, tutorials that we have, are you going over how you built that site step by step? Which one? The, the camera and yes. the blog site? Yes, step by step. Start to finish, including installing open ads, banner rotation, uh, ad tracking system. Thank you. Getting the codes, dropping them in there, modifications. Five minutes? How do we run out of time again? This is an overview anyhow, so don't worry about it. <clears throat> yeah, this one. This is step-by-step, start-to-finish, including installing openads.org, real-time, took Anthony 38 minutes. If you didn't have to install all the open ads, it would have been less. That includes the domain pointing, building the themes, all that stuff. I think the domain pointing is in there, too. So 38 minutes. And it's not like he's working like a whirlwind. We've got people that can do this stuff for us all over the place, different walks of life. You don't have to be a programmer to do it. It's very simple. Jessica Elba rocks. Dory and I own that property. My wife's shaking her head. I love Jessica Alba. <laughs> but the point was is that my business partner, Dory and I, and Jeffrey are business partners on TKP. <clears throat> and I said, well, I'd like to have a nice-looking site. This is a Joomla site. If you saw this thing live, we'll see if we can get it up for you later. I don't know. If, is there an internet connection on this one? Does anyone know? Let's see what we can do for you here. Because actually we're running a sweepstakes. I don't seem to have a connection. It's not hard work. It doesn't matter. We'll show it to you. It's a really nice site. We're running a sweepstakes on this site. <clears throat> Uh, I don't want to switch around with that. I appreciate that. We'll, we'll find it out. We'll show it to you. The point I'm trying to make is <clears throat> highly competitive market. That's why I chose it. Fanatical members. That's why I chose it. We're running a sweepstakes. If you can see it, this is really quite impressive. It's a Joomla installation through our system. And it's got flash pictures that fade in and fade out. We're running a, a sweepstakes on this site. And we're, Will, can you get us alive? Oh, get me alive and we'll show it. <clears throat> and it's got all this fancy stuff. The point is, it's Joomla. Anyone can install it. This is one of the sites where we tested sweepstake stuff on. I've got the results I'll show you later, but it's really quite easy. People tell me, well, how can you get members to a membership site? Well, I can show you. I've talked about it for years, and we actually did a test for this. So, Dory, did you do some linking stuff for this, too, for your presentation? In your presentation? Well, you know. We can do that. So, okay. Yeah. She took it to a PR4 very quick. Yep. First page in Google, 20 categories. And then my test was, can we get memberships? Members, dirt cheap. And the test results were 26 members for every 25 cents that I spent trying to get them. So we had hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of members, but not a lot of money. And I'll tell you the reason why we're doing this site later, too. And so, can I spell, and so the reason you chose Joomla versus WordPress is because you want a membership site. And that's the, the basic difference between the two infrastructures that you put underneath? No, our, our software will install either or for us. We could have gone either way. But Joomla is a much more robust system, and we wanted to do, they can load up videos, they can load up pictures, they can vote, they have forums. You can do that stuff with WordPress. But it's just harder. It's just more stable and more highly scalable on Joomla, in my opinion, okay. from our experience. So. so this site's a membership site. Dory's going to show you on her. She'll talk about it, too. I'll talk about the sweepstakes that we tied into it. 
all that stuff will be talked about. It's a great looking site. I wish we had a live internet for it. That's just one of the sites. It's Joomla. <clears throat> Sweepstakes. This is from JessicaAlberRocks.com. I just put up a page, giving away a free iPod. We talked about how do you build lists and do it inexpensively. Bob's going to talk about that. I believe your presentation is about contests and sweepstakes. We've built a decent list. Well, <clears throat> why would I want to build a list for free seekers? Well, if they're freebie internet marketing seekers, I probably wouldn't because I don't want to sell I couldn't sell them anything. But people love free stuff. Americans love to win the lottery. They love to win free stuff. I love to win free stuff. Somebody who signs up for one free sweepstakes offer is going to sign up for multiple free sweepstakes offers. I had a friend in my last career whose wife, her job was sitting at home filling out sweepstakes offers. They won free cars. They won free trips. That was her job when she was raising her baby, to go out there and win all these free sweepstakes. I've won sweepstakes online. I won a James B. DVD set, James Bond DVD set one time. I could have said it. Yeah, I could have bought it. I wouldn't have had to wait three weeks for the results either. I love to win free stuff. Don't you guys like to win free stuff? Sure you do. So, did anyone see Frank Kern's video out, that came out a couple weeks ago about AdBright and his new system, mass control, he calls it? Rick saw it. No one else saw that? He didn't do a big launch for it. Um, you will be seeing it because he is going to launch it, and I'm obviously one of the launch partners, but... He's a master at copywriting, and he's a master at talking to people. Frank's one of the funniest guys I've ever seen, and a speaker, he's great, because you enjoy seeing him. Well, he did a video just last week. We had this up before then. But he talked about how he goes over to AdBright, I think it was, which is a CPA network. And the people at AdBright have offers. They'll have their own win a free iPod offer, and they'll pay me as a publisher to put their offer on my website. Or I could send traffic via email to their website. And the one Frank did was, Frank sent an email to his list of people. It wasn't even a target list. It said, hey, here's a way you can get a free $500 gift certificate at sports. Was it PetSmart? Or? Okay. Hydra? Hydra Network. There's so many of them. One of the CPA networks, they all have, we've talked about this extensively in my other presentations, but there's these other CPA networks. We can get you a whole list. In fact, we have a whole list in the house, so we'll try to make sure we get it for you. Um, but what happens is people love free stuff. You build a list. This list cost me 26 signups for 25 cents, and we've got that over and over and over again. We haven't even rolled it out. We've got hundreds of people. Now I can go over to Hydra Networks like Frank did, or I can go over to AdBright, or I can go over to Modern Click, or I can go over to Rocket, anything I want, any of the CPA networks, and I can look for offers for free stuff, free diapers. People love free diapers. People have kids, they have to diapers. Man, diapers are expensive. A lot of people can't afford them. They like to win free diapers. What happens is I go over to AdBright. I find an offer. It appeals to my market. iPods appeal to this market. That's what they signed up for. But in general, I can also mail them other offers and see what else they like. And if I mail out this iPod list, free offers, saying, here's another chance to win another free iPod, do you think they're going to act on it? I can get paid $50 if they sign up for the free iPod. Cell phones, I've got paid $75 to $100 for people being given a free cell phone, free shipping, free accessories. And they paid me $75 to $100. Bucks. It starts at $50 to $75, juice me up. I gotta, we gotta, well, this is an overview. So this is kind of stuff we're covering this entire weekend. 